Hola amigos, Javier here for Home of the Earth. Just had a great time in uh, Santa Marta. In this video, I will be heading to northeastern Colombia, which is uh, more of a desert like environment and uh, is also home to uh, some interesting uh, indigenous uh, Colombian people, which I might. Uh, Go give them a visit uh, if it's uh, not too difficult to do on the bicycle or maybe perhaps with a tour or something oh and yeah I was a, a little bit sick uh, the night before and yesterday I'm not sure if it if it had to do with my uh, yellow fever shot that got in Cartagena I heard that it can have a delayed kind of reaction time Yeah, I took a day off yesterday. I can still kind of hear my voice now that I'm talking. But um, yeah, I'm feeling mostly better. And uh, I should be able to make it today to Palomino, which is about uh, a little over 80 kilometers. kind of laid in a ha hammock I took a cold shower tried to go to bed and then the power came back on just as I was finally falling asleep and the day before actually in uh, Santa Marta it was kind of the same deal where most of the day there was no power so uh, I don't know if this is going to be a recurring thing in uh, Colombia not that it would be a big deal Anyways, so today, heading to Rio Hacha, uh, which is uh, a little bit over 90 kilometers away. And I believe today is when we will start to see 
a change in the vegetation. At least what I can tell from the map. Uh, we still have some greenery left, but uh, I think towards the second half of the day, we'll start reaching a desert-like environment. Hearing a lot of life in there. Rio Hacha. So I made it in last night. Found a hostel, no problem. Wasn't sure what to uh, expect out of Rio Hacha, but it is definitely more authentic Colombian than touristy. Although there definitely are some touristy things to do. Lie on the beach, go for a dip in the ocean. I'll probably do this afternoon uh, if I had to guess after I do a little tour of what seems to be a pretty interesting city and then tomorrow uh, I will do what I came all the way out here far east to do and that is get acquainted with the indigenous YU people which uh, are pretty interesting they are nor Colombian or Venezuelan they can go from one country to another uh, I think they don't pay taxes on, on stuff anyways they have an interesting culture and history and uh, I will be doing a a tour to find out more about it tomorrow so I'm pretty excited about that it should be pretty interesting and uh, I don't usually do tours but doing something like this isn't exactly going for a hike it's a little bit more uh, complex and nuanced so uh, I think this is calls for a, a tour so I hope you enjoyed the journey bicycling from Santa Marta to Palomino and then to Rio Hacha definitely did 
one of these segments among many on my bicycle tour, my first ever bicycle tour from Canada to Argentina. If you're unfamiliar with the journey and you'd like to see an interactive map of everywhere that I've been and everything that I've done on, on this amazing trip, you can see that on my website, followthehumoftheearth.com. And to follow my continuing adventures, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you happen to notice that I don't have a thousand subscribers, I'd really appreciate you subscribing uh, because once I reach a thousand, uh, I might get some ads on my channel so I can make a few dollars to keep traveling and keep making videos. Thanks a bunch. Have a great one.